Welcome to another Minotaur tutorial. For this content I'll show you some advance. Tank rotation plus my permanent emblem that I use when pushing ranked. Welcome to Mobile Legends! Five First thing to do is find where Litha Wanderer will respawn. Smash them! Request back all troops deployed! We shall battle under the starlight! Mostly junglers start their buff according to Litha's position. Just wait for a while, you will see that no one starts taking. When you drag the map, This hammer was forged by the light of the cosmos! Try to steal the enemy buff. This will force the enemy to panic. This will give the core of your team a chance to get Press ahead of the enemy since you got Ling's blue buff. As you can see I'm very confident that I control the movement of the core of our team in the early. It's the cooldown and healing effect of pull yourself together. Respawn time is reduced by 15%, while battle spell cooldown is reduced by 15%. This will give you an extra healing effect, and speed up the cooldown of your items. Always be aware, when turtle will respawn, give your core visions. Check the bush always. Correct my hammer. The enemies are here and ready for a fight to find out who will get the turtle. That our core is late and this is what happened next. And shield your resolve! So you can see on the map where our core. It is a big advantage to have a turtle to attack the enemy again. Even if the core of our team is alone. When you make clash, you always signal to your team. So they know and back you up, and you always zone before you start. Shield your resolve! Guided by the stuff. Seal your resolve. Tips when using the Minotaur. Always hit the jungler or crypts or town. So your ultimate is always ready and full before unleashing. I have played. Seal your resolve.
Oh! <laughs> 